Here we finally are, the long-awaited Avatar The Last Airbender English exclusive. So, uh, we've been waiting for this one for a while, and uh, it's definitely a good English exclusive, I think. Uh, they did a pretty good job with that. So, we're going to crack into this, we're going to do a case, we're going to do four trial decks, and we're also going to do a supply set. Uh, if you haven't seen the supply set, uh, <laughs> well, I guess stick around and see it. Uh, it is uh, pretty pretty attractive of a uh, decision they made with it. But uh, if you haven't seen it yet, you'll you'll understand what I mean uh, once we do get to it. Uh, as always, Cardpunk.games, best source for sealed product. Uh, we are still hunting 1,000 subscribers, so we can start doing some giveaways. So if you like free voice sorts, uh, among other things, uh, you may want to give it a subscribe. But uh, other than that, let's go ahead with uh, Avatar. We're going to start with trial decks. Uh, we're opening four trial decks. That's it. That's all we have. Uh, speaking of all we have... We completely sold out every single box, every single trial deck. The only thing I have left as of recording this on Monday, which, thank God, UPS deci or FedEx decided to do their job for once and actually deliver things. So the only thing we have left is supply sets. Um, I ordered a lot of them. I didn't really put them on the website. I took, you know, people said, hey, can I get supply sets? And we uh, took orders on the supply sets, but... We didn't put them on the website, so we luckily have some left. Alright. So that is exciting for those looking for supply sets. Alright. Uh, toss that down there. Four trial decks. Let's get started. Now, I haven't really been looking at the spoilers. I, I've seen a few. I think I've only seen one of the SPs spoiled. So, uh, there are potential surprises for me. I'm very excited for those. Alright, first trial deck. Uh, also, this mat is fantastic. Just saying. Uh, and, uh, the mat is fantastic, but, uh, it is an English exclusive, so it's four per case. So, uh, the play mats are actually going to be pretty cheap compared to others. Alright, so far, most of the card, oh, well, I think all the cards so far are centered around the, uh, the Eclipse. That's interesting. Yeah, still, wow. Wow, the trial deck really has a theme. Alright. So, let's see what the last few cards are those are normally the sps from the set all right maybe not i guess it would be probably the ang and the katara if i had to guess interesting uh we're probably not gonna find out today uh we're only opening four trial decks so uh, let's just pop them open. See if we can uh, maybe get the triple rare would be nice. Alright. Let's see. Alright, so we don't know where the foil is. We did just open a set uh, with Lycoris where the foil was in the middle. So I'm going to be a little more... Oh. Okay. We did get a triple rare. Nice. We got the Zuko triple rare. Alright, I'm just gonna put it right on top of there. And uh, since we only have the four to open, uh, we're sold out otherwise. That means uh, someone's getting that in their playset. So, hope they enjoy that. Free extra triple rare upgrade for them. Alright. And what do we got here? Still got two more chances. Does look like it's at the back like normal, so we can just uh, kind of fan through. Alright, and one more. See if we get the SP or not. That would be nice to get an SP, but 
one deck left out of uh, 48 in the case, which this is not from a case for the record. Uh, this is an additional display that I bought just for a uh, single trial. Well, actually, I have four. Four extra displays just for trial decks. So this doesn't affect anyone who did get a display, but no SP. All right. That is four trial decks down. Now we get to the supply set. This... This is some quality bushy, I'm gonna be honest. Look at those sleeves right there, oh my god. This is uh, definitely definitely a nice little supply set they made here. Let's see if I can, uh, let's just tackle it from the side, seems easier. All right, I think there's like five packs in here or something. Does it say here? Uh, yeah, five packs. All right, very nice. So first, let's take a look at the deck box. Pretty damn cool, honestly. Uh, this was actually my favorite thing <laughs> from the spoilers. Uh, when they first announced the set, sent out the sales sheets, uh, I saw this. I think I even made an Instagram post. I was like, something along the lines of anyone who didn't pre-order this is just silly this is fantastic so iconic i love it oh it comes with a promo pack as well oh hot damn i forgot that existed uh i think the last supply set we opened was ruby uh which did come with a promo pack i just completely forgot about it right, let's see if we can actually get this out say anything on here okay so it says the Names of the promos in there. Okay. 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 Zuko looks. Uh, Zuko looks a little interesting there, in a chibi form with the uh, blue mask. Okay. Uh, now let's get to our five full packs, and then we'll open a full case. So uh, we got a lot of packs ahead of us. That's for sure. All right. Uh, we'll go through these five packs and the first box for Commons on Commons, uh, just so you all can, uh, see the goods. Alright. Let's see if this supply set was a winner. So, in addition to SPs and Seeker Rares, there's also Avatar Rares. Uh, I haven't seen what they look like. Ooh, that's not bad. A triple rare out of five packs. That's pretty cool. Of course, we're literally only opening this for the sleeves on the deck box, let's be honest. That's what I'm looking for here. Alright. Alright. So most of the cards so far look like they're from uh, the later end of the series. So that's pretty cool. Where it got uh, pretty action-packed. Boomy. Oh, and we got a double rare. So a double rare and a triple rare out of five packs. I am not complaining with that. All right. Yep, so that looks like uh, what we're getting here. All right, so nothing flashy. But we have 18 boxes to open, so we will uh, we'll get a few flashy cards. Uh, on that note, though, I'm going to give you guys a quick pause while I clean up this area, and then we will get straight into the boxes. All right, and we're back. So, first box. Let's go ahead and rip it open and see what our promo is. I said rip it open. There we go. All right. I'm actually going to put those up there. Give myself a little extra room. I'm used to the big play man, not the uh, smaller one. Oh, look at that non foil Zuko. Alright. Very convenient promo to have gotten. Back to back. Alright. Very cool. Let's start ripping through these packs. Uh, as always, first box will go through uncommons and commons as well. 
not just looking for the flashy stuff right oh, which is good because nothing flashy in there oh I forgot my new sorting method all right let's see if we can remember to keep doing that it actually did really help with the lycris though so fan of it for sure first double rare yeah, second, if you're not counting, if you're counting the supply set. Got the Toff. All right. Three packs in there. Eh? Interesting. I don't really know what we're hoping for. Uh, I don't know what the ratio is. I'm guessing it's probably two SPs, a couple avatar rares, uh, probably a, oh, a wanted poster for Toph. Probably, I don't know. I would assume that's what it's gonna be at least. We'll find out. And then uh, there are secret rares, so it's probably one per case as normal. Looks like we got another double rare. We got a second copy of Aang. Oh, I was hoping I was going to say uh, the quote when she actually said she would check if she sees it. Sorry, didn't mean to skip one, even though we've already seen it. Alright, we're almost halfway done with the box. Uh, oh, left its little, uh, a lot of commons, uh, going in the trash. Alright. Very nice looking climax. Dance of the Dragons, Form of the Dragons, something. It's been a hot minute. Got the Katara. I actually remember specifically watching the very first episode of this show. Uh, I really wanted to watch it. I knew it ahead of time I really wanted to watch it. So my parents wanted to go out to eat that night. I told them I had to be back. <laughs> yeah, I'm like 10 to 12-ish. And I just am like, no, we have to be back by this time. Uh, and they're like, fine. So we picked up food. We picked up, uh, we went to a fish shop. And I remember I got a fried clam sandwich. And I remember putting far too much ketchup on it. But, and then I remember sitting down and watching the very first episode of Avatar. It's, uh, it's weird what you're capable of remembering. Watching the first episode, I would understand remembering, but, uh, exactly what you ate while watching that episode is, uh, a little different, I think. I don't know if I can say that about any other shows. Oh, that's just one card. I thought I skipped over one. Oh, we got a shiny. Not counting supply set. This is our first one. Zuko and Iroh Forgiveness. That's pretty nice. So that's a good scene. Iroh didn't even need to be asked for forgiveness. He already forgave. Alright. I wonder if they're going to end up doing um, Legend of Korra next year. I don't know how well that would do. 
uh, I think a lot of people didn't end up watching that compared to the first Avatar. Uh, the first Avatar was just so widely watched at that time. I feel like Korra didn't get enough love. It was a pretty decent season. Or actually it was two seasons, wasn't it? Yeah, I think it was two seasons for Korra. Got a Zuko double rare. Alright, last pack. First box. Alright, we have 17 more boxes where that came from. So let's go ahead and up the speed a little bit. See if we can crack through those pretty quick. Ouch. All right. <laughs> Got Zuko again. Okay. Well, I'll be impressed if we don't get a Zuko SP out of here after opening three promos in a row for him. And again, I was really expecting a Takina SP uh, out of that Lycris box. That, <laughs> that really was leading towards that. Uh, it just felt like it was constant Takina. Uh, actually, speaking of the Takina SP, uh, someone posted on the subreddit for Weiss Swartz. Uh, they got the Takina SP. I clicked in the comments to say congratulations, and someone had asked them, where they bought it from. Apparently they bought one box from me. <laughs> so uh, that's extra congratulations to that person. Uh, I'm still opening slow, I don't know why. That's not what we wanna be doing here. I was flipping through them like we still need to uh, take a look at each card. Uh, that's five, okay. All right, now I got a Take a box or two to get into my flow. My goodness gracious. The English packs are just so rough to open lately. I don't know what they're doing different, but that's something. All right, that one's, that one's good. How many SRs are there? Uh, 22, so it should be a normal ratio. We shouldn't see a ton of boxes with double foils in them. Man, these really are from late in the uh, final book, though. Or at least mostly from the final book, it seems. I expect to see a little bit more from the beginning. I don't think I've seen one scene out of book one yet. Ooh, a triple rare. Colors of Fire. Very nice. Actually looks pretty cool. In all honesty, in the foil. Alright, well, triple rares normally come with uh, SRs or SPs. I, I'm assuming Avatar rares as well <laughs> as a possibility. Uh, so we probably will get another foil on this one. It's not guaranteed, but just from experience. A couple double rares in a row, though. We definitely need those. I'm pretty sure everything here is from Bossing Say and Up. That's interesting. Wow, Azulu even gets a double rare. Not a character I actually expect to have a double rare. All right. Ooh, there is our second foil. Aang learning the Avatar state. I guess that one's before Ba Sing Se. Well, I don't know, because Boomy was before and after, but this kind of looks when he's on his throne, so it's probably before. So I think I over-exaggerated a little bit there. Very cool. 
And I guess them uh, even going to the library was before Ba Sung Se. Yeah, so that's just a huge over-exaggeration, turns out. Disregard my thoughts and opinions. They are not particularly relevant. Double Climax box. Alright, not a bad box too. We got a triple rare and an SR. Let's see what box number... Ooh. Alright, oh. I thought I cut that enough for sure that it would open easily. See what we got. Well, it's not a Zuko. Got the Toph for our promo. All right. All right, third box. We are a sixth of the way finished. Well, that's just a common. Let me be honest, that, that pack felt good to open. I uh, opened right up. Right. Do you want to see what the Avatar rares look like? I don't think I've seen one yet uh, in the spoiler season. So that could be pretty cool. I assume they'll kind of be uh, generic with just uh, maybe like some gold stamps near the bottom. Uh, kind of like the Seven Deadly Sin rares, the Lycris Recoil rares, you know, that kind of stuff. Ooh, speaking of foils, we've got an Azula. Azula. Not Zulu, Azula. Okay, and their final duel. Nice double rare. Always happy to hit double rares. Make sure our play sets get completed. I think after this pack, we're going to have to already move our piles over. Make sure nothing collapses. Right, uh, oh, we actually have more packs in this box left than I thought. All right. I don't think we got that double rare yet. I know we had an Aang, but uh, it was a much later Aang before that. Ooh. Oh. oh, that's an Avatar rare. So it's just an OFR, basically. No, not even. What are we doing? <laughs> The hell is an avatar rare? What's different about this? The text box almost looks like an OFR, but it just blends a little bit more. It still exists. I don't know. I was expecting some kind of stamp. It's unfortunate. All right, well, I do need to go get sleeves. So I'm gonna get sleeves, move my commons, and be right back. All right, we got our sleeves. We can give Ty Lee the respect she deserves. Still don't know what the difference is between this and uh, most cards, but it is technically a rarity. All right, two more packs left in the box. Let's see if there's any double rares left. There is. And then we get to go on to box number four. 
Alright, so we technically have a hit already. How many hits are in the box? Eh, we'll figure it out, right? Toss the rares over there. Oh, man. This plastic wrap is just unforgiving today. Alright. Okay, we got a Sokka. Alright, so we are getting non Zuko promos. That's a good sign. Alright. I think we're a bit more in the groove of opening. So we should be going a little bit faster now. Don't want to keep you here forever. Especially since we already had the uh, supply set and trial decks open. That uh, certainly adds extra time to the opening. And obscene packs. Do not want to let go. Alright. Those definitely add some time too. Certainly adds up in the end. Got a triple rare, a pretty iconic triple rare, even with Aang defeating the Fire Lord. Very cool, very cool. All right, well, with every triple rare comes another foil. So, this box still has a little excitement left in it. I wonder if Toph is the only wanted poster. I doubt there'd be more in double rares at this point, but in general, I wonder if she's the only one. I'd say hers was probably the funniest, so that would make sense. Second foil, SR, right near the end of the show. Alright, couple more packs, three. Uh, hopefully we have at least one double rare left. I haven't been counting, but just want to make sure we get all our double rares. There we go. That's one. Alright. We are on to box number five. Let's see if we can get anything special. Well, I can say I would love to see what the secret rares look like. Uh, if a box wants to give us secret rares, that would be nice. Got the Katara promo. Sorry, foil was uh, a little crooked there. Double rare right off the bat. Fills my heart with some joy. Oh, that one's four. Uh, I always have packs confuse me thinking I didn't grab four. That flex slot will uh, always be my nemesis.
At least they took the climaxes out of the flex slot for the double climax packs. That uh that's a change I can appreciate. Ooh. Plenty of packs left. These, uh, for some reason they look a little deceptive. Ooh, what do we got? We got a Suki. Very cool. Very cool. Let's see if there's a second rare or not, or a second foil or not in this box. We always are interested in more foils. Ho, ho, ho! Another Avatar Rare. All right. Very cool. So that's Avatar Rare number two. Just put it right down there. And grab a sleeve. Ooh, almost uh, spilled all my sleeves. There's about 80 left in that pack, so that would not be great. Alright, so we have two Avatar Rares now. Okay. Uh, two and five boxes. Seems way more than I would expect on average. Uh, I'm still expecting there only be two or three in a box. Or in a case. Sorry. But, I mean, if there's more than that, that's fine with me too. The more shiny cardboard we can get, the better. I've been saying that for... Better part of 27 years, probably, at this point. Alright, and a double rare. Good box. Avatar rare, SR. Good box. Alright. Box number six. Let's see if it's going to be just as good or not. Yeah, with this being an English exclusive and having the extra rarities, though, I really am only expecting uh, two SPs or an SP and a secret rare. I don't think it's going to end up being a three SP set. Just doesn't feel like it. Of course, it's Monday, so I haven't seen anyone open this. Uh, since it's not out yet. So, I have no idea. <laughs> Please open nicely, Pax. You're killing me here. I really feel like we're six boxes in, and this is the first time I've seen this double rare. That's strange. I don't know how accurate that is, but it's the first time I'm noticing it. That was a good episode, honestly. Uh, when they were in that, uh... Was it a river city? I don't know what you'd really call it. A swamp city? Something. That was a pretty good episode, all in all. Oop. Yeah, we're gonna have to move piles again after this. Normally the piles are good for three to four boxes. We got, hey, we just got this as a rare. Very interesting. All right. Well, definitely like the SR. It's nice and shiny. Very cool. Dragon of the West. 
title that seems well deserved. That's a pretty nice foil, though. There we are. These packs are a little brutal on average. I wish we could have uh, copyrighted music on videos. I think it would be fun to play uh, a bunch of songs from Avatar. Uh, well, I mean, any IP we're opening at any time. I was thinking about that the other night. It would be pretty nifty. Definitely help, uh, <laughs> help on my videos where most of it's just uh, no noise other than the packs being open. Shift commons there. Grab a pile of uncommons. And foils. Or not foils, climaxes. Uh, sorry I keep moving the mat around. It's, uh, it's a very slick surface on another slick surface. So uh, it has a bit of a mind to itself. Box number seven. We're officially into the second third of the case. Oh, must pack. Not sure that's a good one. All right. Let's see if it is a good one. I wanted to stay in the box very badly. Nope, it is just disappointment. Fair enough. Uh, it does have a CR. Uh, we do need CRs for playsets, so could be worse. Ooh, we got a ooh an SP actually. Uh, <laughs> That's really hard to see the SP, the stamp up there. I don't know about that one, champs. Uh, that one does not show up well. All right, well, that is an SP. I'll, I'll give it that. It's really hard to tell, but it's an SP. All right. This is uh, not the easiest thing to see. I don't think green lettering was the choice for this one. Or perhaps the art wasn't the choice for this one. If they wanted green, which it makes sense to have green on hers. But uh, that's definitely a little rough to see. I was uh, not really expecting that to be an SP when I pulled it out. Alright, well, we got our very first SP. And it's on a pretty badass character, so that's pretty cool. Uh, hopefully not our last SP. We still don't know the ratios, but hopefully not our last SP. Or if it's our last SP, hopefully we get the one of the secret rares. I think it said there were two. Uh, wouldn't argue with a secret rare. I can tell you that much. Well, that doesn't mean we should have another foil in this box, at least. Feels rare that the SP comes before the other foil. Uh, speaking of other foil, we got Momo. That's effing adorable. Very cool. Alright, well, that's the foils for the box. Now you get to watch me open the rest. 
see if there's, uh, oh, there's almost definitely a couple double rares left. Oh, these packs are such a drag today. One more pack after this. And we're getting a nice fresh box and at least one fresh foil out of it. Alright. Box number eight. Just listen one more and we'll be halfway done. I don't know what the timer is right now, but. Doesn't feel too slow, apparently. I'm not gonna say it feels like we're going super fast, but it doesn't feel too slow. Got to end Avatar Aang for a promo. Like a lot of our first packs have been the double climax packs, though. I feel like that's at least our third box that had double climax in the first pack. Hmm. Started difficult to open, but uh, ended pretty fine. Got another wanted poster for Toph. Ooh, we got an SR. Nice looking Katara fighting in the cave. Let's see. We've had one foil box. May I have another? I may have another very nice invention of metal bending. I wasn't actually expecting a second foil. Just count that as a bonus, I guess. I think that's already our third triple rare, isn't it? Maybe I'm thinking of the supply set as well, actually. So maybe our second from the booster case, third counting the supply set. All right, last pack of this box. Number nine. We're about to be half 
way done. Please just open. Oh, I'm tired of the wrapping on these ones. Ouch. Just hurt myself on cardboard. Uh, inanimate objects are the most dangerous things for me. Right. Let's see what these 16 packs have in store for us. Uh, nothing in that one. I don't know why, I just got so scared thinking I wasn't recording. <laughs> I was not ready for that to be a thing that happened. Okay, shaped up in the end. I don't know why. This this one looked foiled to me at first. That was uh that was interesting. I was like, how is the sixth card foil? But for some reason I was just seeing the rare behind it. But speaking of foil, very cool. IROT server. Not gonna lie, I'm hoping they did an avatar rare of Iro. If not, I'll be a little sad. Got a triple rare. Very cool. It's actually a really good scene, too. When they were doing the fight. That's pretty damn cool. Get these piles out of here. Never ending common piles we have. Alright, let's get to one more box. Officially halfway done. Alright, lucky box number 10. I don't know how true that is. But, uh, good vibes. Third Katara. Alright. Let's see, let's see. There we go. Thank you. Ooh, ooh, that is 
so disappointing. <laughs> I saw blue. I was like, oh my gosh, it's a Katara. It was not. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Sokka. Okay. Well, that wasn't Katara. We were excited hoping for Katara, but that wasn't Katara. We did get her brother, though. All right, so that's SP number two. Well, I mean, we're probably getting just the two. But uh, I don't know if there's a third somewhere in this case. Might be a long last eight boxes after this. Oh, at least we get foils of some type. We know that. Maybe another Avatar Rare too, actually, since I feel like we should get three. I just feel like it would be the right number to put in. Uh, I mean, if they want to do three SPs, though, I'm happy with that, too. Three SPs, two Avatar Rares? I'd be okay with that. <coughs> Excuse me. Alright. So I had a bit of bit of a throat cleaning moment there. Oh man. That was uh that was a tad sad. <laughs> Honestly. Seeing the blue I the only one I could think of right away was Katara. That was it. I didn't even think uh, about Sokka having an SP, honestly. He is, uh, he is a member of the gang, though. That is undisputable, so I guess he deserves one. Two more packs. Two more packs. There is no war in Bossing Say. Quite correct, Mr. Diary Agent. There is none. Alright. What's this? Box? Yeah, 11. Okay. I don't know how I lose count. Every single time, I lose count of what box we're opening. And I have to count the rest of the boxes. <laughs> Alright, oh, fourth Katara. Alright, so we probably uh, aren't getting any more of her. At least I'm pretty sure that's the fourth one. Alright. Box 11. <laughs> I really just had to count again. Uh, definitely box 11, though. I do love this card. I'm gonna be honest with you. I did see the spoiler art for it when it came out, and it's easily one of my favorite arts. It really is. Well, now's your time to place your bets. See if we uh, end up with a third stamped card or not. It's always interesting to see what the new ratios are. 
because nothing's ever consistent with Bushy Road almost. Oh, speaking of consistency, they do have their uh, summer summer showcase today. So it's gonna be interesting to see tonight. Plastic, could I convince you? Thank you. Okay. Ooh, foil. <laughs> Warm welcoming <laughs> when they uh, caught him waiting for Suki. That, that was a cute scene. Three more packs. Still a potential second foil in this box, I think. Again, I'm unprepared to keep track of almost anything, so that's not guaranteed, but you know, I try. Last pack. Seven more boxes to go. Getting close to the home stretch here. Trying not to let the cases drop, or the case drop. It's on a very small stool holding up the uh, box for the case. Alright, what do we got here? Another Saka. packs here we go I feel like I've missed a couple of these. I think this is only the fourth one I've noticed. The foil is really hard to see and it's not even actually on the picture, it's just down here. Like I literally see no foil on the picture itself. Like the level is foil, the bottom is foil, the text box is foil, but on the picture itself I literally do not see any foil. I have a strong feeling I'm about to search through comms and uncomments to find a missing one tonight. I feel it. Hmm. I'm really interested in this case ratio. Can't stop thinking about it. Oh, it is three SPs per case. What the hell? All right, well, we got three SPs, zero secret rares. So whoever gets the other case from here is getting the secret rare. Good for you. Uh, I I just kind of lay the cases out and put stickers on them. Uh, so no no favorites here, but whoever gets this case. Gets a secret rare, I think. Very cool. So we got Toph, Saka, and Aang. 
for our SPs. I really cannot believe there were three SPs. I did not expect it at all. Good job, Bushy. Making the English releases slightly better than you used to. And there's no guarantee we don't get a, another Avatar Rare either. Might be three and three. You know? You've, you've done some ratios I haven't been happy with with Seven Deadly Sins. Especially the first one before the Seven Deadly Sin Rares existed. There's our other foil in the box. Uh, and uh, definitely on uh, Tokyo Revengers. I was not happy. It was just one SSP per case and uh, then just Revenger Rares. I was not particularly happy about that, personally. Don't get me wrong. Bushy did a great job on the Revenger Rares. They look nice. But uh, I could use some SPs. Just the uh, trial deck ones for Tokyo Revenger, though. No other SPs. Then one SSP per case. Which I can't complain about my case I opened. I did get the SSP I would have wanted out of all of them. So uh, I can't complain. Same with the Lycris, actually. I got the SSP I wanted out of all of them. So uh, not complaining with that one either. That one was uh, fantastic. Alright. That was box number 12. Which means we only have one third of a case remaining. Let's move these commons. Uncommons and climaxes. And then the rares for shits and giggles. Alright. Box number 12. Wait, is this box 13? This is box 13. Yeah. Disregard. We finished box 12. Another Saka. Two in a row for him. Alright. Oops. Let's not put our blade right there. We got surprised with the uh, three SPs though. We didn't get a secret rare, so we're gonna have to look what those look like eventually. I am curious what the secret rares were. I imagine Aang is one of them. If I had to guess, the other one would either be Zuko or uh, Katara. Probably Katara, actually. I'm gonna say probably Aang and Katara are the secret rares. So we didn't get to see either of those. We didn't get to see the, I assume, Katara SP. Be a little weird if they didn't have one for her. Maybe, I think there's what, five SPs? Five SPs, so Aang, Toph, Sokka, Katara, and probably Zuko. So I would assume that's it. So we got to see three out of four. None of the secret rares, obviously, which, I mean, it's a coin flip whether you get the secret rares or not, but probably going to be Aang and Katara if I had to make an educated guess. But I'll take a look after finishing this opening and see what they are. Pretty cool. We almost passed her again. Oh, baby, we almost passed her again. All right. I'd be a little more diligent. Oop, triple rare. Which we all know means a second foil. So let's see if that's an avatar foil 
or an SR. Or an Avatar Rare. Or an SR, I guess. For some reason, I 100% expected it to be in that pack. I was confused when I just saw another common. Ooh, it's like foil! Tough. Alright, so it was just an SR. Again, I don't know if we're in for another Avatar Rare or not. Not many people know the ratio at this point. I know I uh, open pretty late in the day, honestly, because I have to finish work first. So I'm sure someone's already opened a few cases, honestly. But uh, it's a mystery to me. I'm going to say this is box number 14. We have four left to go. Please. I don't know why these, uh, the wrappings on these cases in per or boxes in particular are so intense. They just are. Got a Aang for our promo. Oh, I missed the pack. A good luck pack. Alright, let's see if our good luck pack is actually good luck. That's got a FOIA, I'm calling it. <laughs> that was good luck. <laughs> it didn't have to be a high rarity foil, it's it's just a foil in a pack. I'm gonna still call it a good luck pack. Makes me feel better. Alright, double rare there. Got one foil. We'll see if we get a second one here or not. Certainly not impossible. Oh, it's two of the same climax in a row. For some reason, I thought it was three. That would be weird. Alright, eight more packs. Definitely getting into the home stretch with only four more boxes left to go. I'm still shocked there were four, four, or three uh, SPs. I'm honestly shocked about that. It's nice to be surprised in the positive direction. Especially since we ended up getting an Aang for our last one. It's definitely a pretty good one to get. I don't know, price-wise obviously, but Aang as a character is a pretty good one to get here. I'm st Still a little sad that uh, Sokka, though. I thought it was a Katara for sure. I mean, it makes sense him being blue as well, but I really, really got excited. But the Aang cheered me up, at least. Kind of, kind of brings it back pretty well. All right, last pack of this box is going to be the Fighter. Trying to peel the plastic off the card. There we go. Okay. Thank you, English Packs. You've been so good recently. Alright. Box number 15. Only three left to go. That's only one out of six of the boxes left to go after this. Another Aang. Oh, 
Had another pack stuck to the bottom. We'll see if we get a foil out of that one, too. I know it didn't work the first time, but it worked the second time, so there's hope. It's also completely random, so there is hope as well. No foil. That is how random works. The farther we go in this opening, the more I notice cards that were uh, pre-bossing say. <laughs> like even just that. Was pre bossing say. It did involve someone from the. Oh, never mind. Never mind that. But I do think at this point Avatar is allowed to be spoiled. I'm sorry if you haven't seen it yet. I recommend it, but. You know, at this point, it's, it's your own fault. <laughs> Katara Avatar Rare. So we did get an extra Avatar Rare. Well, extra is a strong word. Okay. We got a third Avatar Rare. I'm going to assume that's the normal ratio then. Three SPs, three Avatar Rares. Uh, which means we're probably just looking for some uh, SR and Triple Rares in our next box. But very cool. We got another Avatar Rare. So the next three boxes might be uh, a little more boring. Or we could be very, 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 very surprised. Uh, I'm not expecting it, but v it would be a very big surprise if there's uh, more than six hits in uh, each case. I really would. But foils are always great. Nice alternate art cards we get to look at. So, we're still excited for those when they come around. So we did get a Katara. That's not bad. Hey, we got this triple rare in our supply set, actually. So we got a double of that one. That's pretty rare. Well, rare for an opening. Uh... It's not rare to get a double when you get one from a completely different uh, case of cards. But uh, still, pretty rare for an opening to double up on a foil. I, I mean, it has happened. We've definitely gotten double SRs. I think it was in a Quince box too, which is weird. I think it was a Quince set. Might not have been, who knows. I do remember that it happened though. Because it was uh, very shocking. Alright. We are getting real close to the finish line here. Three more boxes to go. Sorry, I could not count for a second. Get my piles out of the way, and we'll do the last three boxes. I think three to four boxes is about when I have to move piles. Mostly around three, honestly. Alright, commons, and just push the commons out of my way. Alright, last three boxes. I want to get rid of this large cardboard. That out of here. All right. All right. So we'll just put them on the stool and get right into them. We are guaranteed foils. We're not necessarily guaranteed any more uh, high rarities, but we're guaranteed foils. So there's a little bit of excitement. Another Saka. Wow. I feel like we got a lot of him. And after the heavy Zuko start. We didn't even get a Zuko high rarity card, except for uh, if you want to count SRs, I guess. They can kind of count as uh, high rarities, can't they? 
Even then, I think we only got one SR and one triple rare with Zuko in it. Alright. Double rare. Love them. I probably love them a lot more than you guys do, but I love them. They all go towards the play sets. Missing one would be uh, very unfortunate. Uh, since we don't have extra boxes, we would actually have to open uh, supply boxes and uh, search for a double rare. Which is uh, not really what I want to do. Those are much more expensive uh, per pack than the boxes. And uh, I only need so many cabbage deck boxes and sleeves. Eventually it becomes too much. So, I'm glad they normally keep their ratios and the case gives us what we need. done with this one. No foil yet, I don't think. None that I've noticed, at least. Unless we got the triple rare in this box, but I don't think we did. Ooh, okay. There's our first foil. Three more packs left. See if we've got a second one in here somewhere. All right. Let's move the high rarities a little farther away from the double rares. Double rares are starting to stack. Getting close to that 80. That's the magic number is 80 double rares. Two more boxes. I still can't believe the set came with three SPs and three Avatar rares. I don't know if that, I assume it's normal. Uh, Bushy Road's pretty good with uh, their printing, but if that's abnormal, I guess all the better if I get more. Well, all the better for me. Alright, we got a tough. Alright. 32 more packs total. Alright, alright. What are our last foils going to be? Are oh, we going to have two or three? What's it going to be, boxes? Two or three foils. Technically, we could do four, and so, well, outside of a shot, but technically. All right. Been, been really trying to look out for that double rare. So I'm hoping I didn't end up missing any, but... We don't know yet. Oop. Oop. We got a first foil. Vengeful Katara, stopping the rain, deciding whether she's going to actually murder a human. Well, no matter what we get in the last two boxes, 
I, uh, I'm pleasantly surprised by the ratios. Which, above all, is a really good sign for future English exclusives. Which, hopefully one gets announced tonight, in fact. There's plenty of sets I'd love to see announced, but... New English exclusives uh, tend to be interesting titles. And that's pretty fun. Avatar, for example, perfect English exclusive. Oh my goodness. That is just right up our alley. All right. And nothing. All right, we got one more box. Minimum one more foil, friends. Let's see if we can get two, though. Two is uh, better than one in this case. I would say so, at least. All right. All right. Zuko back for his return. Okay. Last 16 packs. Last box. Last foils with an S in parentheses. We don't know if there'll be one or two yet, but. Last shot at glory. Last shot at. I don't know, we're not getting a fourth SP, that's ridiculous. Uh, I don't know, I guess last shot at foil still. <laughs> that and double rares are the only things we're still digging for in this case. We, uh, we really did get a lot of uh, high rarities early. So. Got a couple avatar rares and an SP in the very first half of the case, I think. Why, why did I just put that top there? That's strange. Strange even for me. Alright, alright. What do we got left in here? I'm hoping to open a triple rare just so we know we get two uh, foils in the box. That would be nice. It's already been pretty nice to me, I'd say. Shouldn't really ask for too much more, but I wouldn't mind seeing a triple rare. Ooh, well, we got an SR. Okay. Sokka when he's high as fuck. Yep. <laughs> that was certainly a moment. Alright, let's see if we get the triple rare as well, this box. I feel like we've gotten at least four triple rares out of the booster. And then one out of the supply set, so I'm kind of doubtful. But I would not argue with it. That is for sure. I do hope Iroh got an Avatar Rare, though. How many Avatar Rares are there? There's eight. I mean, Ty Lee got an Avatar Rare. Uncle Iroh was way bigger of a character than Ty Lee was. Uh, I'm just hopeful he got one. Alright, looks like three packs left. Are, that's common. Are we getting a triple rare in our last two packs? Double rare, okay. That is helpful. But. It is not a triple rare. Ready? Ah, uh, it's an uncommon. Okay. We tried our best. We got far more SPs than we expected. Uh, let's just... Oh, let's start those three. Let's go through the foils as normal. All right. Let's just take a brief look. See the goodies. Uh, this card should also be that. Yep. Because of our supply set. We got doubles. I do like her look in this one. Just the way 
it's so close to a frown, I guess. It does feel like we got a lot of triple rares, doesn't it? I think there's one more in here too. Yeah, I see it. It's a yellow one. Oh, there's even one more. How many triple rares did we get? That is a lot of triple rares. We're going to count this as one, because we're just counting the booster box. Two, three, four, five, six, seven triple rares in one box? That seems weird. Isn't there only... Let's take a path here. Seven. We got every triple rare in this box. Or in this case. I wonder if that's intentional. That's so interesting. We got one of every triple rare. Alright. Lots well, our SRs and our triple rares. Take a look at our three avatar rares. Got the Katara. Got the Aang. Got the Tai Li, which is an avatar rare for some reason. As for SPs, we got the Aang, the Sokka, and the Toph. Alright, so surprisingly three SPs, three Avatar Rares. No complaints, just surprising. But yeah, uh, if you want your own uh, Avatar cards, I do have the supply set up. Cardpunk.games, best source for sealed product. Uh, if you are looking for boosters or cases, well, <laughs> sold out. Uh, probably about three to four weeks after the pre-order date ended, was when people uh, really seemed to jump on it. So I sold out of all my extras pretty quickly. But that'll happen. I still see a lot of people looking for play sets too. So a lot of people missed out on Avatar for some reason. I thought it would be a lot bigger, honestly. Uh, I know it was a big part of my childhood. Well, childhood, I guess, is a strong term for my low teens. Yeah, since I'm a, I'm a boomer, unfortunately. But I do have the supply set left. Uh, I'm going to have these mats probably at $12.99, I think. Uh, since there are more uh, per case, since it's an English exclusive. So I think we'll have those at like $12.99 plus shipping and go from there. But I uh, hope you guys enjoyed. If you are looking for foils, uh, I'll have the whole brick of foils ready to go on the website as well uh, unless it's already been purchased by the time this video goes live I won't actually advertise it so I don't know if anyone will notice it but it'll be on the website but I hope you guys enjoy you'll be seeing this Friday so have a good weekend peace